everyone so i have a few things i'm going to talk about here even though it's not connected to anything on my channel it's just some issues that have been happening to me recently in school anyways now i'll explain so recently i have been getting into more trouble in school just because i have my hair a little bit tangled and also i have long nails also because i didn't tie my hair and so many problems like ugh, that's annoying anyways i'll explain now so um just yesterday i got into trouble because my hair wasn't tied really okay you see i don't like to tie my hair especially because my hair is pretty short and it's not covering my ears i don't like my ears being shown i just don't like my hair like that i like even my ears being covered and also a bit of the side of my face something like that if that's how i can explain it but, unfortunately, my teacher wants me to not have any hairs on my face. And she says it's because it will go to my eyes. Are you kidding me? Like, I even have a hair clip. Yes, I have a hair clip, but uh, she still got mad at me. Even though last time she said I always need to wear a hair clip. I wear a hair clip today, and I still get in trouble. And apparently now I have to tie my hair. Even the last time I met the requirements, like, I have to put a hair clip yeah i did put a hair clip i met the requirements but now i have to have a ponytail and what about my classmates only some of them are having a ponytail or tying their hair but some like most of them don't excuse me that is unfair isn't it like one of my classmates even have their hair covering their eyes and i'm not even covering my eyes i don't get it how come my classmate who's covering her eyes doesn't get in trouble but i always get in trouble just for not having a ponytail <sighs> that's so unfair i don't get it <sighs> like nothing's even wrong with having no hair clip or no ponytail no headband or hairband like, what's even the problem of my face being covered? It's not like my eyes are being covered. I can still focus in class. It's not affecting my learning at all. Like, is there something wrong with hiding your face just a little bit? I'm not insecure or anything. Not really insecure, but... Like, there is no problem. They even thought somebody was bullying me just because I'm putting my hair on my face. But there is no problem with that. I just like like that it's also more comfortable for me i just don't get it why are they treating me like i'm some sort of maid who needs to follow every single rule like the others aren't even following the rules that much like look at the others some of them don't even have a ponytail like like i mentioned earlier and i always getting into trouble just because of that it's so unfair you know and another problem is my nails. As you have seen my nails a few times in my live streams, as you know, I pick up my paper Athens and murder drones with the with my fingers. And you can see my long nails, they're definitely visible. Yes, that is true. But I still got into trouble. No, they don't watch my live streams, but they caught my nails being long. And I got into trouble for it. They said I need to cut my nails because I might scratch myself and have a wound or I might accidentally hurt somebody. Excuse me? Do you not observe me enough? Like, the only thing they're trying to observe about me right now is what my hair looks like. Like, if I have a ponytail or a hairband or if my nails are long or short. That's the only thing they're trying to observe, but they're not trying to observe my actions with my long nails and my hair. It's not like I'm going to hit somebody with my hair. It's not like I'm going to scratch somebody with my nails. Like, I haven't even scratched a single person yet. And also, I'm very, very careful with my nails. Like, I've had long nails for a really long time. Even when I was still five, I had long nails. Like, for many years, I had long nails, and yet I had no problem with having such long nails. Like, it's, it doesn't even look long to me anymore. Yes, for others, it's super duper long, even longer than a ruler. Apparently, it's longer than a ruler now. 
But I don't even see it long because I've had it long for many years and I also don't hurt anybody. They don't see I'm not trying to hurt anybody. Like, I don't even want to hurt anybody. I don't even hurt myself with my nails. Like, I don't even have a single problem with my nails. It's rare that I have a problem with it. Like, the only problems I have is if it breaks at a random time. Like, when I was playing Piggy, I noticed it broke. And I had to cut it short. Which is why I accidentally deleted my main pet in Cute Cat and Puppy World. Ugh. And I'm always getting into trouble for such things like this. Like, there's barely any problem if the others have always slipped through and not get into trouble while well, I'm getting into trouble. I just don't get it, guys. Why is it like this? Why am I, like, being targeted by my teacher, but she barely looks at the others? She barely gets them into trouble just because their hair is covering their eyes and their face? Well, I'm always getting into trouble just because it covers my face a little bit. I just don't get it sometimes. Like, I rarely get it anymore. Life is getting hard now because I'm always being targeted and everything. I'm not special at all. Like, in some ways, I don't have any special care or disabilities that they have to pay full attention to me. Like, I don't even have any personality problems. I'm a normal person and yet they're treating me like I'm some sort of beast. It's really hard to understand. It's really hard for me to understand, like, why I'm always being treated so oddly. Sometimes even people from other grade levels treat me weird. Like, this one kid, this one student from uh, one level higher than us, he's kind of acting weird to me. Well, you see, he has tried to. Uh, tease me or something like in a not so teasing way i don't really know how to describe this but it's like he's showing signs that he wants to bully me but he won't try it yet he's probably going to try it next time like when he has a chance to bully me but i have no idea like what he even wants like what he's trying to plan is he trying to bully me or is he trying to just annoy me I don't really know his plans, but it just seems like he wants to bully me in the future. That's just what it seems, and he has kind of made me feel uncomfortable a few times because I barely trust him. I don't trust him, because last time he tripped down one of my classmates on the stairs. He tripped him on the stairs, and my classmate was really hurt and even crying. It was so painful for him. That's why I didn't trust this student from the higher grade level, but I really have a trouble with trusting him now. Even my grammar is wrong now, having grammar mistakes. Yeah, these are quite a few issues that has happened in school, and I just wanted to share it here because I'm just really tired of it. I'm tired of the weirdness and all those things. I'm tired of being treated this weirdly. Like, I don't know why I'm being treated like this by my strict teacher. Like, she's she's being unfair. I, I'm being treated so unfairly. <sighs> Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thank you again and goodbye.